It's like a war zone already out here. Fun fact about me, this has nothing to do with fighting in a war, but I used to be a chef. Back in the day, I first started out as a dishwasher. Working at a hospital, this was back in like 2005. I hated it. Once I got my car, which my brother had sold to me for a dollar, yeah, the DMV knew what's up. I went straight to looking for a restaurant job. And so I find myself applying at the Cheesecake Factory and they're like, hey, are you interested in being a prep cook? I said, well, I don't have any experience, but I do like to cook and I love to learn. So I'm in. Next thing you know, I'm a prep cook at the Cheesecake Factory. Now, mind you, at this point in time, I've never eaten there before, but I was like, you know what? I'm about to go ahead and just start learning. I was asking around like, what kind of restaurant is this? And people were telling me, oh man, it's, it's, it's pretty upscale. I'm like, all right, cool. So two weeks in, I'm over here just learning how to do all the prep stuff. And let me tell you, man, I kept messing up. I was messing up a lot. Just trying to remember all their recipes and whatnot. Well, anyway, what wound up happening was after my second week, they're like, hey, there's an opening over here as a line cook. And you did say you wanted to learn how to cook some more. So do you want it? I was like, well, man, two weeks I get a promotion? Yeah. So they put me in the salad station. I wasn't too impressed when I heard the salad station. Up until I actually worked it, I was like, yo, this is intense because at the time, there was like 30 different dishes and every dish had an average of 15 to 20 different ingredients. So I was like, yo, this is way too much to learn. And at the time I was in college, I was doing, co I was doing college full time and working full time. So you already know that was a lot for me. But here I am in the salad station, just learning how to cook. Then I eventually get a transfer to a newer Cheesecake Factory restaurant, and they were giving me more opportunities there. So I went from salad to making the cold sandwiches and pizzas. Then I was on the deep fryer and the flat top grill. It was dope. I was in the kitchen for like a good four and a half years. Five if you include working at the hospital. And that's the funny part. That's normally like where you start out. Like typically you start out as the dishwasher and then become a prep cook and then you become a line cook. Now I say chef, you know, cause that's like the typical term that a lot of people know, but to be a legitimate chef, you're the chief of the kitchen. That's what chef is. It's the French term for, for chief. However, when I went to Bonefish Grill, um, I was an assistant kitchen manager. And it was me and another dude. But we didn't have a kitchen manager. They fired that guy. So we were the head um, guys there. So yeah, you could still say that I was a chef. But when I was a line cook, man... Those were the times. And anybody has worked in a restaurant, you already know what I'm talking about. Yeah, it was fun, but it's highly stressful. Do I recommend it as a career? Absolutely not, because you'd be working very long hours. You're on your feet all day long. You know, it's killer on your back, you know, on your feet. If you have a relationship, yeah, that 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 might uh, put a strain on it because you know you don't get to see your special someone too often. Oh, let me get this dude right here. Ah, oh, damn. All right. So anyway, back when I was in Cheesecake Factory, yeah, like I had a lot of fun there, um, but there was some some stressful moments unnecessarily. Sometimes you got you know, some managers that you know, they just get ridiculous, man. And, and they be asking for like the most impossible things. And, you know, it's pretty unrealistic because when it comes to like a corporate type of restaurant like that. Yeah, man, it's all numbers. It's all it's all sales. That's all they care about. You know, it gets pretty disgusting, man. 
telling you. But the friends that I made from there, yeah, it was pretty cool, man. It was definitely a different experience. At one point, I kind of considered like becoming, you know, like a chef, like as a career, but I was like, nah, I like film too much, man. No, I take it back. I love film too much. <laughs> but either way, man, both careers is like very strenuous when it comes to your time. I also know some people that continued um, the chef route and they're not happy. Pretty miserable. It gets bad. I know some health here somewhere. Here we go. But there was definitely a lot of uh, things I learned how to make from scratch. It was pretty cool. And for any fellas out there that want to impress a lady, I'm telling you, cooking is the way to go. <laughs> but sometimes it could be a real killer, man, because let me tell you, when you start working at like higher end restaurants, you start looking down upon the, the, the places where you used to eat at. Like I remember when I used to love going to Applebee's and whatnot, I would get some some of my favorite dishes from there. And I'm gonna be honest with you, it wasn't a whole lot of favorite dishes that I had. You know, it was mainly like the wings, the burgers. You know, I, I still enjoy the burgers from Applebee's um you know they're pretty good I'm not gonna say like they're, they're, they're the best in the world you know it's enough that that I can enjoy it well anyway you start eating some other things and you're gonna like man I could definitely make this a lot better or like this sauce sucks or you know something but um so you gotta be mindful of that because like your 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 quality starts raising up Start looking down upon certain places. Definitely not going to want to go to McDonald's anymore after that. You know, sometimes we used to be in friendly competition. I remember one time when I was on the flat top grill, right? We had two of them. Two flat tops and two deep fryers. And so my station had eight burritos walking in. And I'm like, yo, there's not enough space. So my manager, he told one of the other guys on the other flat top grill, he was like, hey, you help out Steve. Go ahead and cook for them. And he's going to cook for. And there was no special orders, no nothing, right? So that was the easier part. And we decided to race each other. Yeah, he beat me by like a couple of seconds, man. Like he had those four burritos out. <laughs> and these aren't little burritos, man. Like pretty much look at it this way. It's... For like that, your average size guy is from your elbow to your wrist. It's like about a foot long. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I gotta, I gotta blow these dudes up. Yo, it used to be so busy that you would have the kitchen managers jumping on the line and like billing some of us out because like so many dishes was just walking in especially like on a saturday forget it those saturday nights at the cheesecake factory were brutal but nothing compares to mother's day because mother's day whoo man let me tell you this one i got a funny story the first mother's day that i've done and i was still brand new right i went in i was still i was still new as a as a line cook at the salad station but they didn't want me helping out on the line they knew that i was gonna hold them back because it was like what my first or second week as a line cook something like that and so pretty much they were like, all right, you're going to be floating around. You're going to be helping everybody. And I'm like, all right, I'm not really looking forward to it, but whatever. So they had me prepping like a bunch of stuff, like chopping up parsley and whatnot, bringing it to the line, chopping up lettuce, a whole bunch of things. Every time they were calling stuff from the back, I had to bring it up to the front. So when I was doing that, it was just an all day thing too. I forgot to mention that I was pulling a double. So they wanted me in in, in the morning. And it kind of pissed me off too, man. Because it's like I was working a double, floating around. Meanwhile, 
no nobody else was, was really pulling a double like the, there was a good amount of people that that they went home and i'm like yo why am i you know being stuck doing the double like what's up and so towards the end of the no actually towards the middle of the day the dishwasher machine breaks and so you can't have that on mother's day so what wound up happening was they pretty much got a whole bunch of us to get back there and start hand washing stuff and you know you only got so much space they had a call the guys from who is it eco lab or something i forget the company name but you know they they're, they they pretty much do, deal with kitchens uh, i'm sure they probably deal with other you know um industries as well but mainly kitchens from what i i recall and so what winds up happening is the guys come start repairing it and then it's good to go and then you got other issues going on that we're running out of stuff you know it, it, it was just utter chaos you know towards the end of the day man yeah i earned my stripes i was pretty much really exhausted um but i think they gave me a steak for dinner because <laughs> the cool thing was you got to whoa did that thing just float the cool thing was you got to order almost whatever you wanted, you know, on a typical basis. Just so long as it, it wasn't steaks and seafood. But yeah, I was getting yelled at that day. And then at the end, I'm over here being told that I did a good job. And I'm like, yo, I thought like I was pissed at me. <laughs> but I'm going to admit, I didn't think I was going to be cut out for that line of work. And next thing you know it you know years later i'm i'm still i'm still cooking and i'm training people and getting cross trained in different areas i learned how to do pastas i was cooking on the grill and i was making a whole bunch of things from scratch i eventually left cheesecake factory because it was kind of far from where i was living at and the amount of money that i was spending on gas just wasn't making any sense so i was like you know what I'm out of here. I'm going to go to Bonefish, even though they're going to pay a little less. And I figured it would make up for for the, the gas prices that I was paying. Well, here's the thing. They did say that they was going to um, have me as an assistant manager anyway. So I'm like, all right, cool. You know, that's the whole purpose. So it took them forever to cross train me because they were like, all right, you know, three months in, they were like, all right, you're getting promoted. I'm like, OK, cool. So when this training began, I'm like, ah, it's gonna, you know, begin in like about a week or so. And then one week they got somebody training me and then I'm back on the line again. And then, and then, you know, like a few weeks later, I'm, I'm trained over here, over there. And it, it wasn't consistent. Like it, it was honestly aggravating. And so then when, 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 when they got serious about, you know, training me consistently, it was pretty much like, oh, okay. Um, you got... You got this amount of time to, you know, do certain things, you know, throughout the day. So like I was, I was doing, you know, receiving of, of, of the, of the produce and, you know, the meats and all that. And then I'm over here, uh, checking stuff on the line, but yo, I hated it, man. Cause I had some enemies. These guys ain't like me cause I was younger than them and, and, and I was able to keep up. Mind you, they were like in their, I think the youngest one was like in his late 20s. Uh, the rest of them were in like their 30s and 40s. And, you know, they saw that I was able to hold my own. Um, they were all also family too. So, you know, they, they, they take too kindly to anybody outside of that. And even some of the other guys warned me too. Which sucked, but whatever. I did what I had to do. I eventually got fired from that place because when when I had like a, a certain situation going down where like this dude wanted to, you know, freaking fight me because uh, I didn't do something to to the certain way that 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 he wanted. And I'm like, all right, dude, like my bad. Yeah, so this dude got all up in my face. I had my witnesses. And um, when I was asked about it, the general manager, I flat out told her. I said, yo, I don't like it here. And I, I gave my reasons why. And so the next day, she calls me in the office. And she's telling me that um, 
that we should go our separate ways. I was like, hold up, you firing me? She was like, yeah, because you're not happy here. I said, listen, I ain't come here, you know, to make friends. I came here, do what I got to do and collect the check. And I was like, and as far as I'm concerned, that's exactly what I'm doing. And she was like, yeah, but you know, like if, if, if you're not happy and I'm like, well, you know, that's, that's not my fault. You know, it's the way that, that, that you're running things. Like what you want me to do? Like, yo, like if, if, if you got your employees, they're telling you they're not happy, you don't fire them. You, you try to assess the situation to make sure, you know, you could do whatever it is that you need to do to accommodate and, and, and make them happy. But you're going to run away and go ahead and be like, no, I'm, I'm just going to fire you because I think that's going to be the best solution. All right, whatever. So I was like, oh, so you fire me again. I asked her and she was like, yeah, I'm like, OK, that's all I needed. So for when unemployment comes comes around, can't sit here and say that I quit. Nah, your own words. You fired me. So I was out. Whoa. Oh, man, the doors closed on me. <laughs> so when they got rid of me, I was like, you know what? It's got to be one of the best days of my life because I was also working part time at a furniture spot because my boy had hooked me up with that job. He actually became my supervisor. And so when I told them that I got a part time job, they also didn't like it because they wanted, you know, my my full attention. If you know, if you want to look at it that way. And I'm like, yo, you over here to give me this promotion with a dollar raise. You know, none of these guys are, 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 are respecting me because I'm younger than them. I was like, you know what? Go ahead. Keep your dollar. I really spoke my mind a lot. <laughs> You know, I ain't had these issues in any other job. It was only this spot, you know. That that restaurant was so toxic. Those were my days as a chef, man. I'm done with the restaurant industry. You could keep that. To the rescue. Yeah, this game was so dope, man. Like, I played this when I was like in eighth grade, and it was just so, so good. I remember when, when I had rented this. I think I, 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 rent, I rented it twice, just to beat it, because you know, at first it was hard. Now, granted, I'm getting my butt kicked right now, but you know, I'm still doing, still doing better than before, because now I know where to go. It was also fun playing four players, like, shooting each other. But when part two came out, Sarge's Heroes, I don't know. I wasn't too crazy about it. It definitely had, like, a different feel to it, you know. I played a few of the Army Men games, not all of them, but the ones that I played. I played World War, and I think Land, Sea, and Air, if, if that's the same one or not. Not entirely sure. Uh, controlling is not easy it's hard it sucks i mean the controlling kind of sucks in this game too but you know the gameplay and everything the feel good vibes it makes up for it yo this dude had a bazooka trying to kill me ain't there a guy over here yeah pop him in his head nice headshot bomb stupid you too catch you off guard while you're on guard. Boom. Oh. Sorry. Oh. There he fell. He fell. Alright. Oh, I fell too. Well, these guys are after me. Clear line of sight. Might as well get him. Get you. And you. Damn, just realized <laughs> I ran out of bullets. Man, too bad we can't just go up to them and punch them. I actually have a fist fight over here. You know what? I'm about to get that flamethrower. Melt some of these fools. Down to the plastic. Because they are plastic. Oh, 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 yeah. No, no, not there. All right. Oh, that hurt me. That was stupid. Warzone. 
Whoa, whoa. Forgot how many of these guys there are. Gotta clear the room. Sarge walking like a badass. Oh. Bomb. Oh, this guy's trying to annihilate me. Missile's flying right by me. Damn, only got three bullets left. That was careless. Oh, made a count. Yo. He's just respawning. Oh. Oh. Perfect jump. Good timing. Otherwise, I don't think I would have made it. Oh, man. These guys are stopping at nothing. At nothing. I didn't see these up here last time. Yeah, that's what I wanted last time. This bad boy. I love the sniper. Yo, Sarge is a champ. He gets banged up, gets some first aid kit, and he says, good to go. It's nothing. Let's keep it moving. All right, you know what? I'm about to learn my lesson from last time. Need a bird's eye view. See, somebody's already shooting me. Aw, oh, there they go. Doink. Pink. Oh, that tree is in the way. Bink. There we go. That's where the bink works. Hope it doesn't hit the floor. Got him. What's the dude shooting at? Oh. Man, this is why I got annihilated last time. They were everywhere. Eh. I don't care so much about getting that. Oh. Damn it. Hello. Goodbye. No. I gotta go back and get some health. Well, now that I'm up here. Party time. Anything in here? No. Yeah. I like that it's health, you know, replenishing you all the way. Not a little bit of here and a little bit over there. The whole shebang. I see somebody. Who can it be now? Da -da 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 -da. Oh. Damn, this ha they had this place on lock. Did anybody ever have little army men toys that they used to play with? I had some. I think I think uh, the reason why I bought it was for like a class project or something. I don't really remember how I got my hands on them. And then I started playing pretend. Well, playing pretend. Well, you know, playing with the toys. And I was like, hey, this ain't half bad. It's pretty cool. Let me annihilate this fool really quick. Yo, even in my crosshairs. Finally. Where at? Oh, right there. Oof. It's like pennies. Little chips. Where? Oh. Man, he was pointing right there at his feet. And I like how they have that little detail, like a little circle on their back. Sly Fox. Damn, bro, you just dipping? I thought he was gonna start doing push ups. Might not make it. Ooh, that was good. Might as well get all my shots in. Alright, whatever. Look at this guy. That was weird. And I think that's a wrap. Oh, yeah, should have known, should have known better. Everybody coming out to play. Get 
Get out of here. Get out of here. Yeah, maybe I should buy some some army men toys for my sons. Put them under a magnifying glass. Looks like some of my guys were already dead here. That sucks. Got some reggae playing in the background, okay. When you come in for these tan guys, you gotta come correct. Here we go, here we go. No. Oh. Come on, man. The controlling on this game is not the best. But everything else makes up for it. If you guys need to comment below if y'all played this game, if you enjoyed it or not, or any of the other army men games. If you guys like what I'm doing, like and subscribe. Tell me what games you want to see played. Most likely, we've both played them. No! Bro, I saw you. Don't even play. These guys be coming out of nowhere. Sometimes you gotta check behind the, 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 the patch of grass. Can't even say a bush or a tree, because, you know, the reality is it's not. Please don't see me. You saw me. Come on, man. You're making me nervous, dude. It's like about 10 of them that will take them out. Oh, less. I guess 10 if you keep missing. Like a duck. I went all the way around the world. No. No. I mean to jump. Oh, there you are. There you were. Oh, the ants! Stupid bugs! Oh, God. Well, these guys got bugs on their side. It's a straight kill. Yeah? I'm looking at you, too. Oh, no. No! No! It bounced off the wall. Oh, okay. It hit him. No. There we go. All right, the rest of the guys ain't gonna be too difficult. It's coming at me, huh? Where's my flamethrower? I wanna burn them. Put them to a magnifying glass. Gotcha, oh! Another one. Catch this, bro. I guess he was already dead. Damn. Wasted no time. Oh, I gotta take him out. Oh. No. That's my stop. That's why I still got health back here, somewhere. Ooh. That was my flamethrower that I wanted. Here it goes. Yo, I can't see that dude. Now I can. Tired of wasting my bullets. Oh, there he goes. 
the Sarge. Yeah, they made him a dummy. Let's pop his head really quick. Be done with it. Yo, but who's the kid that owns these guys? We got to keep that in mind. It's like Toy Story almost, if you think about it. Yo, this guy's really shooting me. Oh, him too. Bro, get out of here. Yeah, dance around for me. Dance and melt. Get down, get down, get down, get down tonight. Burn you up. Want to see what happens if I kill him? Oh, I thought it was. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I was ready to restart. <laughs> up, up, and away. What the kind of face was that? We go bye bye. Why is she the only one that actually got human skin tone? Sarge. Yo, look behind you. The enemy is right there, you idiot. That's what happens when you don't have a monitor. Damn. A little styrofoam cup. Plastro. This guy's evil, man. That fiend. Leave it to me, Colonel. I'll get her back. Plus, I got a crush on her. Yo, I thought she was taking a dump. She just kicked this dude right in the nuts. Bro, she don't take no crap from nobody. And that green hair. She looked like one of the wrestlers from the 90s. You got a big ass picture of your daughter. Yo, this level, it was always hard for me. This one gave me a run for my money. Gotta take these fools out. Someone gotta deal with them later. Ooh, go in my line of sight, dude. There we go. It's not where you're at, it's where you're gonna be. Remember that, kids. Ooh. Bro, this was the Call of Duty before Call of Duty. <laughs> Yo, my man, you ain't hear those gunshots? Your boy is murked. Oh. This is how you used to handle this one-shot deal. Yo. I got him, but not the guys that it was intended for. No. Right here. Yo, it just jerked their neck. All right, you know what? Nah, screw that. You? Where's the other dude at? He's hiding somewhere. Or was he up there with me? Oh well. Bro, jump, dude. Not for nothing. I I did really like these stages. They were a lot of fun. The game was just dope altogether. Brings me back to my younger days, which is why we like playing these things. You know what I mean? Oh man, Good to go. I forgot that it could do that. That was a steep fall, too. All right, headshots all day. Oh, this dude. Oh, nobody across. Oh, the bridge. Oh, no, that stuff's in the way. Oh. Party time. No, what am I doing? Oh. 
I already knew that was coming out. But damn, they got thrown back again. <laughs> Where's the... Where do I gotta go? It's not there, is it? Well, I guess it's... Oh, it's up here. Okay. Whoops. And they're ready to kill me. I'm ready to kill them too. Can't even go through the trees. Nighty night. Bro, I'm about to blow the helicopter up. Where is it? Hmm. Surveilling over here. Damn. Think that'll reach them? Yeah, it did. I saw you flinch, man. I never really went this route. When when I first played this. I think I just went out there in the field. Cause I really don't remember doing this. Right through the window. Anybody else? This guy. Bro, if you don't cut it out, you know that hurt you. Stop trying to be tough. Ah. Oh. Stuck. I've been spotted. And want me to do oh yeah I gotta climb up here I really don't remember this level like this I bet you there's somebody in here set off another alarm Oof. all right let me go over here oh you want to come out As long as there's no tanks, man. Whew. Bro, he came at me with the bazooka. What are we doing? You know, he's on the tower. Rightfully so. I don't want the doors closing on me. Because it did that one time. Yo, it's like Metal Gear. Snake. Tripping on the, the fire alarms. Bro, that should have taken all of you guys out at the same time. This is a long battle. Woo. They need to reboot this game. I mean, remake. They need to remake this game with better graphics. This game was just fun, man. I really can't get over it. Oh! You know what? I'm, I'm just going to go and kill this that whole entire squad. I got to go all that way just to come back to the helipad. You know they wanted to raise the stakes in this game. They're like, we feel halfway in. You know, it's getting pretty easy. Let's make it difficult. But watch when I'm going back through all of these uh, different areas. I'm going to be the one having to shoot my way out. All oh, the gray guys. I forgot about them. Oh, it was like a bug converter thing. Damn, they're cracking up. Turning soldiers into spiders. That madman has gone too far. I hate spiders. That wicked laugh. Kick them. Trap. Hang on, buddy. Well, now I gotta kill the spiders. Hey, hold up. 
You're right behind me. I know I saw you. Yeah, I'm about to kill these spiders. Come on, Shrap. That was like too close. I don't know. We gotta break out of here, bro. Before the whole tan army is in on us. Don't sweat, dude. You know what I'm saying? Stay tight. Don't call me dude. Damn, the game's slowing down. Bro, I know you're gonna shoot me. So, see? Look at the map. I gotta shoot my way out. Come on, man. No. I don't wanna have to deal with you later. Where are you? There you are. Yo, where'd you go? Come on, you idiot. Why are you still back there? I'm trying to rescue you and you want to hang out with the enemies? Fine, be my guest. Don't ever say I ain't doing anything for you. Oh my god. This guy decided to stay back there. Knowing very well it's not easy for me to open these doors. Oh my god. Come on, dude. Bro. This dude's giving me anxiety right now. Right here. Come on. Before the door closes on you and you die. What a damn fool. I think one time I was playing this a long time ago and he was taking his sweet time and I didn't even realize it. But he was already gone. Like so far away. I was like, bro, I gotta go all the way back. I'm over here thinking you were right behind me and you weren't. Because you wanna be a moron. You gotta be like right in front of it. Oh god. Come come. It's not that difficult. Alright. War is upon us. I see you. Mm -mm. Yo, come on, dude. I'm about to die here. Let's go. This guy's a moron. I'm about to shoot him. He gonna get us killed. Bro, this dude is stuck. Oh crap. Get all that for nothing. Come on, man. Let's go. Over here. There we go. Sheesh. Stop calling me dude. Alright, dude. Man, you got these guys on the towers, ready to get me. Oh, 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 this guy's dropping the deuce. Bomb. Give me that sniper. These little alphabet blocks. All right. Oh. oh. Somebody got me. Somebody. Of course. We good? Coast is clear. The clear is coast. Getting like right in the appendix. Got him. He gonna be hurting for a while. Oh. Bro, shoot. What happened here? Oh my god, that was terrible. Good thing that there's health. Yo, I was... Mm -mm. That was terrible. That was me. That was me. Damn, that sucked. Ooh. Ooh.
I gotta deal with this minefield. Oh my god. I was right there. Had I tried to have been courageous and just gone, it would have been a wrap. All right, let me, let me chill out. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, you got a shotgun. They didn't even touch me. A sniper's dream. Bro, I'm just trying to catch somebody picking their nose. Get you nuts. Oh, he's ready for me. Bro, he souped. Alright, somebody... Somebody's hitting me. Oh, this dude. Alright, you know what? Gotcha. Whoa. Nah. This dude had me. Look at him, look at him, look at him. Oh boy. I'm pretty sloppy here. I ain't gonna front. Oh, he disappeared off to the bushes. Oh. Is he coming back? Run to me. Right in your face. This dude. Hey, was somebody behind me though? Just a earshot away. Oh. Close enough. Yo, there's a good amount of dudes out here. Oh my goodness. Did I get him? I did. Hold up. There's always somebody here. Bomb, got you. I gotta turn this off. You guys shouldn't be having so much things plugged in here. All right, I gotta locate and enter the patrol. I mean the portal. Yo, I don't got enough. Gotta make these bullets count. Oh. Get happy. Who's that back there? What's he doing? Hmm, blow you up, bro. Got you. Oh, bro. No, 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 no. Oh, man. Nah, I don't trust you. I know what you did last time. Yo, these fools are gonna be coming out the woodwork. Ooh. What? terrible miss me miss me by a mile kind of looks like the wild west over here feels like it got you oh man these guys are everywhere Okay, I can hide there. Oh, I got them all. That's how it should be. Alright, what open? Here? Oh, ambush.
Bro, shoot. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. That was a dumb strategy. Nah. <laughs> I didn't want to battle them. I'm like, screw that. You could keep that, man. Go ahead. Ah, they got me. Drop it or she dies. All right, Plastro. Well, she had no choice but to betray us, right? Damn, you betrayed me with a kiss? This makes no sense. What is that? Sand? Hollow sand? Shouldn't the whole thing collapse? See, it's games like this that teach you you gotta look everywhere. You might miss something. Yo, I'm gonna go arm to the teeth. Give me that shoddy. Sarge is not messing around. Oh man, they got one of my guys. Look at that. Disgusting. Oh! Gotta take this dude out. Yo, that felt like such a 90s movie. You just pop out, hey! And just shoot. I was outnumbered by like how much? Ooh. Yo, you almost had me, dude. That's how they got all my guys here. Okay. Whoa. Nah. Great. I don't got a mind detector. Who? I saw the guy. Yo, you really trying to throw yourself on the ground, rolling around so I don't get you? I got you. Yeah, they up in the stakes in this in, in this level. They rolling around. Lo and behold, right in front of me. One more step, I would have been done. Yo, you see that one right there? That's where I got that guy. This is accuracy right here. Oof. Rest in peace to my fallen soldiers. Oh, damn. Was I behind enemy lines? Bro. Stop running around in circles and face them. Come on. Was this the backyard? Mm mm. Mm mm. Mm mm. Not today. Yo! They're going all in. I need to get that health. I know I, know I see some first aid. Oh. See that dog bowl over there, precious. Oh, here you go. Oh, man. You were holding them hostage, huh? Have at you. Scorch. 
What a name. We all know what he uses. Bomb burn all you suckers. Yo, this dude's just waiting there. Bro, Scorch, fight back. What you doing? Scorch, you suck, man. That heroic ass music playing. Come on, let's go. Hurry up. Bro. Get out of the ditch. Come on. You're gonna be the reason why I don't beat this level. Here we go. This dude looks pissed. Douche. Back to the beach. Bro, get out of here. Oh, oh. That was stupid. Alright, good. Nobody around. Mines. Mines. Watch well, it be like right in front of my foot. Well, it wasn't nearby. Oh, yo, they protected this thing. Yo, too bad I can't whack people with this. You know what I mean? Oh, I see this dude. Oh, for real? I can't hit you? There we go. I was in a bad spot. That was embarrassing, too. There we go. Gotcha. Okay, nothing over here. Now, this reminds me of those toys where it was like these log cabin things and you could build whatever. I mean, I never had it, but I seen it. My friend told me he had it. Bomb. Oh, try not to fall off, bro. Yo. I'm behind enemy lines right now. Yo, what was that other dude before? He was up there. Nah, I don't trust this. Oh, there. Oh. Not right now, Slim. Bro. The dude, man, was right in front of me. He didn't even take the shot. What a loser. Alright. No! Well, you know what? I'm trying to go up here anyway. It's closer. Ah. Uh, hold on. Get it, dude. That's right, it's party time. I'm trying to blow somebody up. Oh. Yo, dude, you ain't died from that? Come on. That was clean, bro. Good thing there's a lot of uh, first aid kits around, because I wouldn't have made it, you know? Do I need that? No, I don't feel like climbing all that. Bro. Oh. Oh, yeah? No! Damn, I ran out of fuel, man. I didn't realize it. You still up there? I'm about to find out. Who's shooting at me now? Oh, you? Oh. Got you. Yo, we gotta be out, too. Well, this is more accurate. Yo, 
Yo, you hit nothing though. We have bazooka, bro. Let me show you how it's done. You want party time? Well, maybe I should wait till somebody shows up there. Oh. No? Somebody. Oh. Damn, they're trying to annihilate me. Whew. I see this dude. He really thought nobody saw him. Nah, man, not today. Your plan crumbled. All right. Come on, roof man. Gotcha, right in the neck. Oh, there's a helicopter. Oh, man. Yo, there's so, so many places to go. Oh boy. Damn it. Run! Run! Ah. You know what, man? Right here. Clean shot. Bomb. Don't blow up by me. Ah. Oh, I got health, so. Oh no. Another one? No! Ain't that that's near him. You know what, bro? I'm just gonna snipe him out. Two of them. Look at this guy, bro. Like I don't see you. I didn't mean to get that health, but whatever. It's in my inventory now. Yeah, y'all think y'all crazy. Uh-uh. Oh, boy. I'm all out of... Oh. Nope. I'm not. Reload. What's up, buddy? Right in the face. See, man, I get hurt from falling down from such heights. Oh! Standing on business, huh? God, I hate it when that happens. Yo, this level is... Challenging. Is it two guns? Oh, it is. Alright, nobody's up here. Yeah, you like the way I just jumped up and shot him right in the chest? It's my style. Alright, this is where I was supposed to go. Wait, did I just... I should have gone in that cup, huh? Uh, I wasted time. Oh. Damn, this is it. This is where Sarge dies. Sarge is jacked up. And all me in the muscular way. Oh boy. Can I 
take these guys out. Oh, health. Good to go. Bro. Yo, who else is out there? Oh, you! Come here, face death. Sly Fox, this is Bravo Leader 1, objective secured. Huh. Bro, look at that. They coming in. Oh! I forgot about this dude, the giant robots. Damn, no wonder I got so many bazookas. This is to take these guys out. Destroy the super weapons. <laughs> Not a problem. Where are they at? Oh. Come on, man. Face them. Dude. Oh. Super weapons. Yo, turn around quick, dude. There we go. Oh. See you. Yo, they're tough. It's worse than a tank. See, a tank takes two. This thing is just taking like... Ten. Oh, good. It killed them. Bro, help me shoot him. Get to the portal. Come on. Make haste. Vicky over here. Oh. They're about to kill her. They're going to finish what they started. Poor Vicky. No signs of Plastro or Vicky. Oh no, no. Run! Fire in the hole! With this happy music. Oh, I said the portal's destroyed. Sarge, help, Vicky. Uh, how <laughs> he spun around that gun. Secure, heartbreak pass, get to skyrocket. Bro, I wish I could carry home my weapons from, like, the previous stage. Or I would have been set. If you really think about it, you know, you know what I mean? I gotta snipe all these fools out. Yo, yo, yo. No. Damn tank is in the way. Got him. Yo, you gotta take everybody out. And they're blending in with the sand. We gotta clear out. Oh man, you're violent today. You guys got no remorse. Oh man, there's so many places to go. I gotta go in here. Yo, it's a war zone. What did I walk into? That's what I like usually when you come across an enemy with a particular weapon in that area, you're going to find those weapons. It's kind of like you're picking up their guns and their ammo. Oh, whatever that is, I need it. There's a shotgun. It's a good thing I go and touch that health. I love this. Reminds me of Terminator 2. Thump. Bro, you can get one too. Don't worry. I got you. Do I really need the health right now? Probably not. Alright. Alright. Who is it? Who's doing that? You. Somebody's over here. Sniping me out. I can't figure out from where though. 
Come out here, you rap bastard. Ah, oh, there you are. I found you. Sneaky, sneaky. Oh, you missed. You suck. Damn. It's all out war here. You're just standing there like an idiot. Oh. Oh. Yo, these guys came out of nowhere. Oh. I honestly don't remember any of this. Good, I got health right here. Yo. Damn, dude. They got this place secured. Oh. Damn it. Oh, my God. No. No. Yo, the commercials were great for these games, man. There was, like, so much that they were producing. I really wish that they kept it going. Forgot what the slogan was. Real combat, plastic men, I think. Part two had a different feel from this one. I, don't know, I, I think I mentioned it before, but I gotta see it again. To me, this was the best one. Okay. Gotta get down. The controlling of this game does suck. I know I know, I, I've mentioned it before. It sucks. But it's a very charming game. It's, it's a lot of fun. And it makes up for it. The graphics are nice. They're okay. But, you know, this is for the 64. So, like, for back then, I think the graphics were good. I saw this for the PlayStation. Man, it was terrible. I was like, what? Thank God I rented it for the 64. I don't even remember what made me rent it. Maybe I saw a commercial or heard about it. I I, I don't remember. Cover looked fun. So I was like, yeah, why not? I like war games. There's somebody else over here, too. You're annoying, man. All of you guys. This is me against the world. That's what it is. No. I gotta make sure he's dead, you know? Yo, who? Good to go. I don't want to deal with this. Who's down there? I'm like fed up. Oh my god, they're everywhere. They're like cockroaches. Guys are beasts. I see them sparks. Guess I know I hit them. Nope. Oh yeah, there we go. I'm gonna destroy this dude. Anybody else out there? I'm gonna need this. I know it. I don't want to take the health yet. Yo, there's a lot of health here. That That's not a good sign. Oh, boy. <laughs> the heroic music comes on. That only means one thing. Everybody and their mother is going to come out. Ah, oh, the way they staggered this. Oh, you gotta be kidding. Oh, I gotta go on the rocket. It's 
like Toy Story, man. I'm telling you. Damn. To the moon, Alice! Yeah, being in the real world sucks. Don't touch. That's an old school stove, man. They're not playing like that anymore. Well, they some are. Oh, God. Damn it. Oh, they put this here knowing very well that you'll get hurt. Hold up. You mean to tell me somebody puts cans in their sink? Who does that? All right, whatever. See, now as an adult, I'm going to be criticizing the hell out of this. This whole kitchen. Oh, I couldn't get it. Whatever. I ain't going to sweat it. All right, what am I looking at? I gotta make it to the floor. Oh boy. I'm gonna take you out, man. I don't wanna deal with you. I got you. Yeah. I don't got a sniper. Damn it. I remember the knife hurts you. Another one? Get out of here. Blasting me with shotguns. This idiot just standing there looking at me. Oh, health. Okay. I knew it. I was going to say it comes with the price. Oh, my God. This is so difficult, dude. Well, at least I got my sniper. Oh, boy. Anybody else want it? Can't go wrong with crawling. I don't want to slide right off. Was I able to make it into that cover? Speedy rap. What? Bro, I just looked that way. You weren't there? That's crazy. Oh, more health. Oh, my God. Who did this? It was you. Oh, damn. The whole platoon came out. Send in the cavalry. Sarge is too crazy. Come on, man. Hurry up. Oh, where did they come out from? That's wild. I don't trust this toaster. Oh boy. Where'd he go? Oh, here he goes. You about to get dealt with, bro. I, sh I shot way above it. Oh, I see him. Can I take them out from here? No. What if I take Vicky out? No. Bro, you don't stop. All right. Precious. Precious. Stupid dog. Bro, I see you laying down. couple of them are laying down. This guy over here too. I don't know what he's waiting on. I don't know what's up with that. There's got to be something in here for me. Ha. Huh. What do you know? Execution style. No, nothing. All right. Okay, got some bullets for me. I'm just gonna burn them all. 
Why not? Hey, I'm right here. Get out of here, bro. Anybody else? Who did that? Yo, where's that coming from? I don't like being blindsided. That music. Backstabber. It sounds a little bit like Walking Dead. You talk too much. Damn. Picked her up from her head and gave her a kiss. Like, shut up. Let's do this. Let's be out. I ain't trying to hear you. To the end of the counter. Oh, man. Yo, where's the health? That's all I need right now. Oh, my God. Yo, I don't need bullets, dude. I need health. What is going on? Oh, boy. Oh, man. Did I make out like a bandit? I was almost done for. Is this your great escape plan? Heck yeah, bro. I'm Sarge. Yo, she wasn't there before. This little poodle. Sharp ass teeth. That was so trashy. Oh, it's Christmas time, but it looked like summer out there. No, nope, nobody did say it was going to be easy. Look at this dude, man. Somebody's shooting missiles, bro. Yep, I knew you were going to come out. Show your ugly face. Oh, I missed you, huh? Whoo. Whoo. That's a lot. much bullets left what other gun that I got yeah I need that big time all right where should I go Let me try this end such a big map oh boy that Christmas tune oh my god I would like to explore everywhere else, but man, there's just too many enemies. I don't want to be dying here. So much to do, so little time. I know somebody's going to pop up from behind here. Oh, you were right behind me and you missed? Damn, you suck, dude. Oh, a ruler, bridge. And it's broken. I don't know where he was, but he's done now. Cigarette tray. Come on. Get up. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Here it goes. I'm going to put mines on the couch, dude. Ha! You keep looking over there, you idiot. I'm on the side of you. Okay. I see this guy up there waiting for me. Nope. Nope. Not gonna let you. See, I thought I was supposed to go on the other side, but just wasted time. Oh, dude. Well, he kept missing. Is that necessary? Oh, 
man. So I'm supposed to go all the way over there. You know what? I could really use those weapons over there. So. Look at this. Oh, oh, yeah. Do I got a sniper? I do. That's not worth it. I didn't realize the candle was lit. Unless I just go through it really quick. Yeah. All right. Cool. Damn. I got hurt real bad. Good to go. What? Bro, where were you? That's a lie. Yep, not surprised. Anybody else? Anybody else? Okay. Yeah, this looks good. Oh boy. I look like I I feel, I feel like I'm going to get hurt. Yeah. Somebody's here. Yeah, eat that. Bro, this dude. Don't tell me that ain't burn you. There we go. Yes. Yeah. You betcha I'm going to be happy. I'm going to put you out real quick. See what they doing to me? Oh, no. Oh, I see the Nintendo 64. There's a kid gonna get a Nintendo 64. Another one up. Okay. Parents are wrapping up the gifts. Secure the tree area. I thought I secured it. Oh, there's still one more dork around. Hold on. Let me go find this fool. I'm hearing him. I'm not seeing him. But well, where is he? Oh. There you are, you fool. Where you at? Come on, man. I'm getting anxiety over here, dude. Reveal yourself. There he is. There they are. Ah. <sighs> Oh. No! You know what? Whatever. Yo, he said face me like a man. Damn.
He got torn up. Oh boy. Nintendo 64. See Bowser on it. Nobody here, huh? Looks a little suspicious. There you are. Come on, man. Shoot him. No. Nope. Can't climb on that. All right. Got to secure all corners, man. These guys be brave. They'll just, like, run up to you and shoot you and stare at you. As if nothing's going to happen to them. Come on, man. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. I'm in his buddy back there. Oh, boy. They got the chopper. Come on, man. Get off the carpet. I mean, onto the carpet. Where are you? Oh, it's right above the present. Here you go. That's all I need to see you, bro. Nope. Oh, man. Oh, God. Gotta go to the bathroom. Drop a deuce. Gotta go take a bath. As my son says, bayeth. I don't know where he got that from. I think this is like the last level. I hope. It's a lengthy game. Oh. You thought you were going to live today, huh? Great. At least I got that. Shut him up. This is funny, this instrumental. Oh. Nope. Turn your back on me, dude. And you missed. Like a duck. Damn it. You're on fire. You gotta jump up. I guess you could stop, drop, and roll, too. Oh. Damn. I just wanna get this. That's it. No. Damn, my man is ruthless. For no apparent reason. Oh, that triggers that? Funny. Anybody up there? Oh, something. Oh, boy. I hate when you're getting shot at. No! Oh, man. I know someone's going to pop up from around here. There's a little outhouse. Anything in there? No. God, I hate it when that happens. Damn, you guys are really taking care of me today, huh? Look like I beat you out to the punch. Oh. Good thing something's in the way. You're missing. Wait. What's that over here? Huh. Wasn't I already in this same bathtub? Maybe, maybe not. Elsewhere. Okay. 
Dirty toilet. Nasty. Now, who set this up, though? Some kid? I wouldn't let my kids do this. Yeah. Yeah, nothing of this is going to hold up. Who's popping out? Oh, here goes that music. It's about to get real. Oh, the big guy. Alright, let me... Hold on. Actually... I haven't seen the TNT this whole game. I almost forgot about it. Alright, where is it? Oh, that was bad. Oh my god. That was... Pathetic. I don't know who's shooting, but I see this guy. And that one. Oh. It's the robot. This also reminds me of uh, Harvey's Humongous Adventure. Does anybody remember that? Probably not. A lot of people don't know about that game. There we go. Oh boy. Here we go. If you don't like it, that's your problem. Where is it? One grenade. That's it. Let me go back. Get that first aid that I deliberately saved. Oop, missed it. I'm probably going to have to run back, so I'm not going to use up that other one. Let's see how many people pop out of here. Vicky! Oh, clocked her. Not so fast, sweetie. Bro, he just hit her whole head. Never mind talking about harm a hair on her head. Look, she's twitching over there, man. He caused her brain damage. Socked his nuts. Yeah, he's insane. What kind of dumb question is that? Save yourself, Vicky. There goes that dog, Precious. The door closed behind her, though. That's crazy, right? that code says damn she just spat out reunited with your pops now who's gonna save me oh all right there I go well done Sarge all in the day's work sir Sarge now, her build is weird Broad ass shoulder. Yo, that's how you kiss women, bro? You pick them up from their head? You're gonna snap their neck. Oh, you have won this battle, Sarge, but our war isn't over yet. The end. Ha! That was fun. Oh, for now. Yeah, that's right. Because they're always at war with each other. Watch this next video because YouTube thinks you will like it. If you haven't already, like and subscribe.